Valkula Sustainability was set up maybe eight, nine years ago. And really its mission is to provide education for the people who are going to change our future. Everything we've built, we've tried to almost use it as a sustainability demo. We care about the materials, we care about where they're sourced from. We really want our students to do a better job than we did of creating a sustainable future. We want them to, to get involved. So all the buildings are built to the highest sustainability standards, so it's long-lasting material, recycled material. We're using a lot of natural wood. We're using a lot of black locust. If I remember correctly, it can last up to about 100 years. It's very hard. So your carpenters all complain at first about how this wears my tools out. But like so much in sustainability, if you invest up front, you get the payoff long term. You become quite obsessive when you are uh, designing these things about how can you make sure there's no waste. We've got a, a sort of natural fall away on the hillside, like, like a natural amphitheater. We sort of terraced it, and then the stage looks as though it's almost floating on this area of very green land. We get a lot of thunderstorms here, which means we get a lot of flash flood. So actually during a storm, the water flows through the amphitheater and beneath the stage is what's called a rain garden. So it's like those big retention ponds you see on building sites, only pretty. It's black locust surface because it's exposed to the rain all year round. The whole idea is that these are, these are the sorts of ideas and ways of approaching problems that we're going to need for the future. So I think we're going to be doing a lot more teaching our students just how do you really work with local communities to build these new futures. Yeah? Often we hear that was a really hard class, but I got so much out of it.